you Sunday? Uh, well, Gary, I, I watched the Cleveland Browns uh, beat the Baltimore Ravens. In Baltimore? in Baltimore? No kidding. That is right. I know. Wow. I know that's a surprise. We both thought they were going to get smeared. The beginning of that game. What the hell started happened? What the hell happened on Sunday? Was I dreaming and I woke up? Is this? It seems tactile. Is this? A, are we? Have we actually entered the realm of winning, beating the Ravens in? Are you aware that in the 50 times that we played the Ravens? They've won. Since 1999. We've won seven times. I think it was seven or nine. It's single digits it, without, it's, without it a question. It was seven because it was six. It was like 25 to so, six. So, so here's what I'm looking at. Here's what I'm looking at, and then I'm going to let you – and then I'm going to turn you loose on okay. people. Okay? First of all, I'm Stefan Welch. And I'm Gary Kaiser. And this is Browns. Browns. Darn right it is. Yeah, we dropped Darn another it. letter. We did drop a letter. Boom. Dropped a letter. So, so would here that it be is. Browns? Okay. Here's what happened. All right. So I'm sitting on a chair just like everybody else. Second play of the game. Who to thunk? And I called it too. I I called it. She was sitting right there. My wife's sitting right there. I go, oh, we're gonna, you know, it's gonna be 14 to nothing in the first two minutes. Those are you as texted God me is my that. witness. As God is my witness, that's what I said. And what happened? 14 to nothing. In the first well, it, three it minutes. started off just like that Pittsburgh game, and then, and then, well, we shut them down in the second quarter. Here's what happened, Steph. Here, here, plain and simple. Here's what happened. Okay, you can't do anything about that deflected pass if a guy puts in the extra effort and gets up that high. We did to them too. Okay, we blocked one too. But if a guy puts up that extra effort, he was had to have been 10 feet off of the ground to block that ball. That was a perfectly thrown pass, easy screen. I mean, we were screening them all afternoon. That right side, we found that hole. Remember we were talking about they're going to find our hole? We found theirs, and it's that little outlet on the right we, side. We just sure off did. the right tackle. And, and, and they had some injuries, but they weren't nah. injuries. It wasn't like... Their quarterback got injured. Or they anything. were they were shell shocked. They first off, uh, they were on their high horse. Odell Beckham only caught one pass, by the way. Odell, why is it that one, these guys, one clowny, he these didn't guys, even, he didn't even block. Well, he's a, I, I can't stand he's a him. baby. He didn't because even block. He for plays his team. well for everybody but Cleveland. He was a prima donna. <laughs> he was and a child. Well, we in had we had, and I. E emailed you, or I texted you some very long things. Yes, you did. <laughs> you probably didn't even get halfway uh, through them. No, I read But it's them. exactly I what I was them. thinking. Exactly what I was thinking. I do the same and, thing. And it was, I turned the television off at 14 to nothing. I'll be quite honest with you, Steph. Wow. I turned it off. Well, remember, I texted you, I can't watch this debacle. You did. So I turned it off. I was sitting at the table, and I go, you know what? I'm done with this. I can't do this. So I said, I'm going to Sarah's, my daughter, and I'm going to help her. Uh, you know, they're getting ready to sell their house, and they're making it look pretty. I'm just going to go over there and and, and, and sweep, right? I couldn't pull myself. No, I turned of course it, you I can't. Turned it We're back Browns on. fans. I turned it back on. Still struggle, struggle, struggle. I have never seen the Browns since the 80s work that hard as a team and like you said play four quarters they, they played play four, four and a half quarters and a half quarters you're absolutely Brutal. right i was just going to say that these guys did not quit and i love they that. were down they were down the entire game they came close to tying it a missed extra point which is a fluke dude, for this guy dude we were behind for the All but 40 seconds of the fourth quarter. <laughs> Are you aware no, no, of no. that? Seven seconds. Seven seconds, whatever. We were, we were, were behind. Seven seconds left. We were behind. And that was deliberate because they had to, remember, they had to use their last time out, uh, the Ravens. But what happened was our defense shut them down in the second quarter. Oh. They didn't score a single point in the second quarter. We scored nine. Deshaun Watson was 14 for 14 in the second half. He was well, perfect. I can, 
only imagine. Perfect. I can only imagine that he got talked to. Well, he was playing on that bum ankle. You see him hobble around? He was uh, on a you bum know what? ankle. I don't care. Then he got hit across care. the face with a forearm, and th- that's when he was on the sideline on his knee. And he told whoever went over to help him up, he said, give me just a second. You can read his lips. Give me just a second. Because he got armed. He, he got he got his belt rung. He got co- uh, cold cocked. But but it wasn't that type of thing. I mean, it twisted him around, but it wasn't a concussive type right, hit. Right, but still, you get a shot like that. He was like, you're, you're give like, me a minute. Yeah, I, I just need a second. So so then they hand the ball off to Jerome or yeah, Jerome Ford. I love that kid. And Air. Er- 11 people ran for 12 yards to get that first down. Did first you down. see that? It was <laughs> incredible. He, he was, they clustered him, and he went another 15 yards. But that, it looked they like, push, a, it, everybody it pushed looked like a rugby scrum. Yeah, that, that's, exactly, that's exactly what it was. I wish and they, I'm there was a name they for didn't it. blow the whistle, but it was constantly moving forward. They couldn't. No, no, it, it was, was forward it was progress. Constantly forward moving progress. Forward. That's exactly that right. Was amazing. They already had the first down. And then Miles Garrett was just—he's just a piece. Of well, he—he he broke just... some kind of record oh, that only oh, yeah. five other guys have yes, done. Yes, yes, he's had—he's had, he's had <laughs> six straight seasons of over ten sacks. Wow! Consecutive seasons with over ten. Well, sacks. how many times did uh, we sack them? Uh, let's see. Uh, I think. Let's see. There were. I mean, we got sacked a bunch too. There were two interceptions. Of course, one was that deflection, but there was two interceptions, and I think you know it wasn't like playing uh, the uh, well, that Cardinals. Horrible. It wasn't like that. Free uh, that, that horrible uh, um, mm, um, dropped punt. Yeah. But, <laughs> oh God. I mean, he, you oh can see my. it too. He took his oh. eyes off the ball. He took his eyes. Well, and you know, why? Russ took his why? eyes off the yeah, ball. You, you were calling fair catch. Najoko was on the sideline sure too. He took his eyes, he eyes sure off. He sure did. Knew, he knew it too. He just stood there for a second and said, "Well, I'm not going to let that happen again." You know what? Because that guy, he was about to get hammered. And then you asked, "How do you miss the extra point?" And I put, "They're the Browns." Exactly. There's but, no science. But there's no science, dude. But he redeemed himself. There, Jeez. there. Wow. In enemy territory. Deep into enemy territory. All the time. They were like down there in the red zone all the time. But like I told you, it was like being in quicksand. It's You hit the 10-yard line. It's like they, they run in slow motion. There's something about but the weird. So they scored weird. touchdowns. Yeah, they did. A lot of them. Well, we had the nine field goals. Mm-hmm. We had the three touchdowns with one missed extra point. Which kept us at what thirty thirty one thirty thirty one at the end of that game, they made sure because remember that one drive, they had the ball for ten minutes. Oh yeah, yeah, almost ten minutes. And that yeah. is what that is what a good football team has to do. The defense should not be on the field more than fifteen minute total minutes mm-hmm. in a game, mm-hmm. and they did. They held them in the. Uh, second quarter and in the fourth quarter. Yeah, managing the clock was brilliant in that game. It was absolutely superb. And I think because of that game, Stefanski will get his extension on his contract. Because I think his contract was up this year. Even if he loses every game from here on out? Well, I don't know about that. Uh, he's not going But, I mean, he I, – I don't see that happening. So, now, I see these guys as a definite – they're only half a game back now. From first place. So, Thursday night, the Ravens play Cincinnati in Cincinnati. Okay, Cincinnati oh lost. Oh, my God. Cincinnati it's... lost against a very convincing uh, uh, Houston Houston team. Right. Very, very convincing. Didn't we beat them? I Houston. believe we did. Very convincing team. But Cincinnati, do not count Cincinnati out. The Ravens are oh, going to go don't. to Cincinnati. They Joe Burrow the, is one the, of the, the best quarterbacks I've ever seen. Oh, he's excellent. He's excellent. But Look, but but so is you know. Speaking of quarterback, let's get, let's get back to our team. Mm-hmm. I swear, Deshaun runs more than he throws. He runs a lot. Almost but, you every know. play. Is our offensive line that bad? Because no. I mean, it 
that mm -mm. pocket broke down almost every play. No, 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 the pocket did not break down. Uh, the he pocket, just ran out of The it. pocket collapsed a couple of times, but you, okay, you, you're not 100% right. every minute of the game. Sure. You know, Especially against a team like well, that. Well, once they time you, you know, you're you're head to head with the defensive lineman. Once he times what you're doing, you know, he's gonna get around you once or twice. Yeah. He absolutely is. But thank God the guy can run mm -hmm. a little bit. Mm -hmm. Um he's not like Jackson though, who can run and go on his way down, they're throw very, a, a the, connecting pass. They're very similar quarterbacks. Jackson is incredibly accurate, incredible accuracy. Right, threads the needle. See that? That's why Baker was so good. But Baker's too short. In order to, if Baker had two more he, inches, if he had two more it, inches, it, he'd be the next Brady. They won. Tom Brady. I'm they telling won, you. Uh, um, yeah, I know they did. Bucks won. Yeah, which so. is a good. Th that's okay. I, I but like, they're, you know what? They're NFC. I like I'm not that guy. Yeah. Let him win. Mm -hmm. uh, we'll see you. In we'll the, let him we'll, play. We'll see it in the Super Bowl. How's that? Okay, very good. Now I, everybody's saying Super Bowl. I did tune in just a little bit on the Ravens Ravens YouTube channel. Oh, they are whining like ten year old girls who what? just lost. What was what was the uh, bitching about? I'm sorry, I didn't mean to use that word. What was the whining about? Oh, you you every, can bleep every, that word. Everything. Everything. The penalties against the Ravens. There weren't that many penalties in that game, by the way. That's three straight games with what I thought a very light touch from the officials. And, and yes. you know what? I think because of all the stuff that's been going yeah, on. Yeah, they're like, they're like, they're like that, you know what? We're on their microscope now. That, that's why that scrum. And did, you know why? Don't blow that whistle. You know why? Because we pointed it out. What else did we point this, out, Stuff This show mm -hmm. has become so incredibly powerful in media. Seems and, to be, and, doesn't and, it? Uh, can you pat me on the back? Because I can't quite reach. Okay. There you go. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Well, I got a crick in my neck and a sore shoulder from patting myself on the back. Yeah. Yes. That's why yeah. I let somebody else yeah. do it. Oh, I got some. I got some massage cream up there. It works. It works wonders for Ben for, Gay. <laughs> Is he? No, I mean, I'm sure I do, he is. I do. Okay. <laughs> Does so he I make you feel good? <laughs> okay, that's enough. All right. Of that, I mean, but okay. the, 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 the Deshaun Watson clearly not not doing his thing. And Hopkins redeemed himself. We managed to stay with them. We came from a big deficit. Fourteen points against the Ravens at home is a huge deficit. And, and uh, very few penalties. Mm -hmm. We played a tough game. Our defense stepped up. Our offense stepped up. So good. I felt so good at that game. And, so here's and, and, and here's what I like. They didn't look back on what they screwed up. Like Njoku, he didn't stop and whine that he dropped that pass. He went no. and played his game. Right, but you can see the disappointment on his face. At that moment. He was like, Mm -hmm. At that mm -hmm. moment, he, there's no one to blame but myself That's on right. that one. And you know what? He's a you, beast. You dude. go back. He is so strong. And he, and and you just play your game. And he caught a few more. And passes. they did. He was it, he, the, the whole offense really stepped up, um, especially in the second half. So I love the Fords, the defensive Ford and the offensive oh, Ford. Aren't God. they tough? And it was so funny because the Ford made that tackle. I go. I didn't know he was on his... <laughs> I know, and I said, no, that's no, the other Ford. No, different Ford. guy, different the other Ford. Ford. Okay, I, no. I didn't realize that. No, but, uh, yeah, what a great what a great game. What a great win for the oh, Cleveland dude, Browns and the people out there. So, so, so hang on, hang on. We're going to leave this one go, okay? It is now in the past we're looking forward. That's correct. This is the AFC North weekend. Yes, because we all play each other. That is correct. Here's the earth is going to shift by Sunday. So you've got the Ravens playing the Cincinnati Bengals Thursday night. You've got Pittsburgh coming to Cleveland Sunday. We're half a game out, but so is Pittsburgh. I want Cincinnati and to Cincinnati's win. Cincinnati's not that far and away. We're going to win. If Cincinnati. If we win and Cincinnati wins and we're in beat, first place. beats the Ravens, we're in first place and Cincinnati's in second place. 
how would they zip ahead? Because they're a game behind. Well, yeah, they are five and four. That's yeah. right. They're five and four. Yeah, they lost. They did. God, they shouldn't have lost, man. That was disappointing. Well, but, I, I but did someone not, had to trip. I did not mind them losing. I just wish Pittsburgh would have lost. Well, uh, they they because here's the thing about interdivision win. games. They were obligated to win. It's like not this weekend now. <laughs> it's <laughs> like uh, when you play an interdivision game. When you win, it's like winning two games. When you lose, it's like losing two games because you, all of a sudden you're two games differential because of that loss or win. Well. We talked about, yeah, you're right. We talked about playing in a hostile environment. Well, Pittsburgh's coming to Cleveland. That's going to be incredibly hostile. Cleveland's not, and it's supposed to rain on Sunday. Okay. Oh, that's my kind of game. It is. It is. It's supposed to rain. It's going to be nice all week. Poor guy. It's going to be nice all week until (laughs) it's going to be nice all week until Sunday. And then all of a sudden the clouds going to open up. It might snow on Sunday. You know, say you know what? Of course, Gary, it's five days out. But I, you know, going, how do you do I'm that? I'm going to be in my warm home, so cozy, there. and on my watch it on my 65 inch. Sure, you are, mm-hmm. and enjoy and enjoy watching a football game. I thoroughly you watch it Thursday night. Even though are you watching Thursday night? Uh, uh, probably. Yeah. Uh, I 100. percent I scared Patty to death. Because I scream. I, me t- they opened the door up here. I had my family upstairs. I came down here to watch a game with my grandson, right? He, he's a huge Ohio State fan. He's now a huge Browns fan. <laughs> a huge How Browns fan. How old is he? Six. Got him just in time. So we're down here and watching. Did you scare him? No, he was yelling too. He was there too. And then Sandy opened door. What are you yelling at? Oh, the Browns game's on. She just shut the door <laughs> again. <laughs> oh, the Browns game's on. Well, now, I, I now, heard now what the did they do? Now what they goes, do? Oh, they won. I thought she liked football. She does, but she had five grandkids or four grandkids upstairs. Oh, for God's sakes! What mm-hmm. is her problem? Well, we reproduce. So, so, real quickly, Ravens against Cincinnati in Cincinnati, another hostile. Uh, Stadium. Do you think Cincinnati's not fired up I right think now? They're going to be fired up. I think the I Ravens think, are on their heels. I think either it could go either way. I think it's going to be a very close game, like ours was. Uh, I don't think it's going to be a blowout. But if it is a blowout, it's going to be Cincinnati's blowout. I agree with you 100. percent It's going to be a tight game. They're not going to give the Ravens that much leash. John Harbaugh is a good coach, even though he's a cheater, but he's a good coach. You know, it's funny. You last week you I'm called you. it. I'm telling you, you said that they did they signed. The, I didn't know anything about it. All of a sudden, it's huge news. You sent mm-hmm. me that article, but yeah, I had it's already the number one thing. I had already seen it, and I was like, "Oh my god!" And they barely mentioned it. On the broadcast, it was real quick, and I bet you somebody whispered in their ears, "Okay, enough of that." It, well, it was, it was, yeah, his brother couldn't, uh, but they won. Yeah. That, that was the big news. Yeah, that's it, and that's all they said about it. That's it. They didn't elaborate at all. But I'm telling nope. you, the nut doesn't fall far from the tree. So, good for us. So here's, well, they're the two nuts from the same tree. <laughs> well, yeah, they are. So the nuts don't fall far from the tree, but I am saying, I know my. Minor attached <laughs> that pretty close to the, the tree. Ravens have something to prove. They're no longer they they now realize with Pittsburgh and Cleveland right on somebody has to win the Pittsburgh Cleveland game. Well, well, not necessarily. I mean, not statistically speaking. Could Some, be a tie. Someone had. It's not going to be a tie. There's no way it's going to be. A, right. Oh, please no. Right. <laughs> please, please no. It can't. Not against Pittsburgh. It can't. No. But we're half the game over Pittsburgh right now, correct? Yeah, because we beat the Ravens. They they didn't. They count that. Of course they do. That's what's what's so great and what's so bad about interdivision games. You've got – you you have – there's four teams. It's an even share. I think we are the only division that all four teams have a winning record. Everybody's talking about AFC North, that if a team from AFC North does not advance to the Super Bowl – there is something seriously or at least wrong in the playoffs. No, AFC Deep North into the playoffs. AFC North is going to the Super Bowl. 
That's all there is to it. Okay, it's just, well, I don't want to jinx it. Who is going to the Super Bowl? I don't want to jinx it. it I didn't say be, the Browns. It could be any one of us. I didn't say the Browns. It could be any one of I still believe that the way this division is playing, oh my gosh. all four of us could end up in the playoffs. Oh, without question. And I think it's going to happen. With the way the, the uh, wild card set up? Yeah, they got more wild cards now. They extended the season by one game. Sure. I think we're going. I think Pittsburgh's going. Um, obviously, I think Ravens are going. What do you guys think? Let us know. Set, I, set up a comment. Because what happens when you send a comment, Well, I'll Gary? tell you what happens while you talk about our sponsor, New... Uh, new Branch, new which bran- has New Fashions... Dot net. New fashions dot uh, net. Be- beautiful clothing. Supple. Uh, and supple. And, and it's, there's that word again. It, it's casual wear mm-hmm. that is so incredibly soft and comfortable. Well, I tell you what, it is you could wear it casually, you could wear it under a shirt, open open collar, you can wear it to the gym. These are very versatile, high quality uh articles of clothing they really from are. a local and, company. And and, and very affordable. And we appreciate New Branch, the folks at newfashions.net. Encourage you to go to their website and take a look. And that's nufashions.net. Dot .net. Thank you, Steph. I appreciate that. So if you do leave a comment, hit that bell. Ding, ding. There it goes. Hit that bell. Leave a comment. And you will be in the running for the 1988 Topps sticker book complete with the stickers. Steph, tell what, them a little exactly, bit about it. No, why don't you? Because I know nothing about this. What is, what's going well, on here, Gary? Well, Steph, what you have is to, everybody knows that Topps is the premier collectible card. Okay. Uh, sports card. I didn't know they had stickers. Oh, they got stickers, buddy. They got oh, stickers. And my this goodness. from 1988, you're talking about Cozart. Why don't you show us a little bit of the inside oh, of Oh, absolutely. Of course I will. Here's the Cincinnati Bengals. Now, if you, now, Boomer, Boomer Siason was in there. Over on this side, you got Jim Kelly oh, and the I, Buffalo, and the Bills. Buffalo Bills. Bills. There's another tough division there, too. <laughs> it, just, it just rolls on. The AFC is tough this year. Yeah, NFC just isn't getting it done. They're really not. So this is a complete book right here, back when the Redskins were the Redskins, the real team, you know. Right. And then you've got the Green Bay Packers well, Doug, here. They Doug were always Williams, tough. the quarterback? Doug Williams was the oh, quarterback. Oh, God, there. that guy used Here's to the throw Lions. rockets. The they Browns. Lar- did they have Largent then, Steve Largent? Uh, the Lion. That was Seattle. The Lions oh, had right. Chuck Long. Uh, um, uh, uh, what's his face? Um, oh God, not Earl uh, Campbell. Man, um, 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 no, he wasn't on the team at that time. He came later. Yeah, you know who I'm talking. I about. I do, and I can't think of his name. Though. All right, so and my God, Detroit oh. is doing great this year. Detroit is awesome. They're they're. Seven and two. Seven might be eight. Seven and two. And two. Now. I don't yeah, but there it is, right there. Leave a comment. Leave the comment, and then we will message you the winner. Well, what, what's a book like this worth? What twenty, thirty bucks? No, nah, hundred, hundred and fifty. Absolutely. Wow. It's very, very collectible, because it's so rare. And it could be yours. And we're going to send it out. We're going to pay the postage to send it out. All you have to do is leave that comment, ring the bell, subscribe to our channel. Let us know what you're doing. Anyway, I mean. You know, yeah, and, and you, can and you get don't this have right to here. like us. It doesn't matter. As a matter of fact, as a matter of fact, we as prefer it's not filthy, uh, so we can read it on the air. Uh, what we're looking for is clever. Now it is a drawing, but we are going to go through and eliminate. Yeah, we because we don't know who our fans are. As a matter of fact, Stefan, on that point, we prefer that you not like us. Truth be told. I mean, we've got enough people. We have enough friends and family that like us. Sure. We don't need our fans to like us. We want our fans to be funny, critical, condescending. Uh, sometimes, offs. yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. okay. Well, there you go. I mean, that's well, the criteria. And you know what else? You know, we were talking about New Branch earlier. Yes. <laughs> Sorry about that. I didn't mean to <laughs> touch you. Uh, go ahead. He wants yeah. to come on the show, and we want him to come when we're doing a show at the brewery. At the Ohio Brewing Company, which is our sponsor when we're on location He there. wants to give away stuff. Okay. So I'm in. Be, I'm game. B 
be looking for There's that. There's room enough for three in this wide, well, wide screen, it right? Will, we'll, we'll bring him in Is he for a, big a guy? segment. Is he a big guy? No. Oh, okay. No. Okay. He's got a big, bushy beard, though. That's okay. That's okay. And... Uh, I, I, he is really looking forward to it. Well, he is so uh, jacked about being a part of this show. Is he a Browns fan? Oh, are you well, maybe me? we can get his two cents worth. Well, he wants to we're put gonna in open his up two the cents worth. We're going to open up the, the the phone lines next week, even in a loss, because we're Browns fans. You know, we don't want. Okay, they might win, they might lose. You don't know what's going to happen with the Cleveland Browns, especially this year. You don't know. Yeah, that's why you can't tell. That's why you don't bet for or against. Rule of thumb: them. You never bet on a Browns game for or ever, against. Ever, ever, you bad, will bad. lose. You will, you will lose because they'll break your heart every single time. Bet on the 49ers or or or, or Tampa Bay. We we're just talking about Tampa Bay. Bet, bet on them. Do not. I say again, it, do not bet on the Browns or against. No, because you'll lose. Because They'll break I your heart. I would have bet on the Ravens. We were both. We kind of lean that way. But that's only because of past performance. But both sides of that ball stepped up. So now, record if Washington breaking, could record, do that, that would be a miracle. It's a record breaking year for the Cleveland Browns. That's why I'll be watching Thursday night with 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 great interest. As to With what Cincinnati, well, Cincinnati, <laughs> I'm going to say right now, Cincinnati must win against Ray, and they have every opportunity to do so. They're they're a beatable team. Can you they're because that team. would put them in that mix, and we're all knotted up again because somebody, I I two teams in our division must lose. I don't want it to be us. No. I, no, I, I, I want, want it to, it to be, be the us. Ravens and Pittsburgh. The two. Yeah. I don't oh, even hate man. Pittsburgh. No, I love not at the all. rivalry. Yeah, absolutely. But the Ravens. No. For obvious reasons. I hate them. I hate, I hate them. And, them. And they're just digging another hole for them as, as far as ethics wise. You know, they don't want to bring that up on the on this coaching staff. And it is unfair but I, I to think, group everybody in one basket. It is. I think you're right. I think they're on their heels now. Sure they and are. And they're going to go into that game, and they're going to not play their game. Cincinnati hope, is going to be ready for them. Gosh, I hope the weather's nasty now. Cincinnati can get pretty sloppy too. That's a natural grass field. Well, Baltimore, it's all the same. It's it kind of is. Kind of. I is mean, it's same. not like it used to be when when the Oilers were in our division, which oh, wow. didn't make any sense to me. No, they had to put somebody in there. So why not? It should have been the yeah, should have been yeah, the Colts when why Indianapolis. Yeah. Why moved. don't we? Uh, why don't we grab uh, a team that's a thousand miles away? By all rights. Yeah. Exactly. I don't know. Did now was it like? Tennessee in our division for a minute? No. Before they split them off into north, south, east, west? No, I think that's the year they split those divisions up. I think part of that it expansion. Used to be east, west, central. Well, that expansion, which also brought in the Panthers and the Jaguars, I think that part, and the Texans, I think that part of that was by design. I don't think they were ever in the north. I think the north was well, firmly. Uh, Titans were. Were they Oilers? They yes. were the Tennessee Oilers yes. for one yes. season. Yes, they were. But gosh, it's hard not to. You know, the Browns moved to Baltimore. It's hard not to keep them in the same. It's hard not. It's hard not to keep them in there. They're AFC. What are you going to do? Yeah. Where are you going to put? Are you going to put them in the East? There's no room in the no. East. Those are legacy mm. teams in the East. But are you seeing New England? They've only won two games. I, I have a feeling this is Belichick last year. Yeah. I, he's de he's definitely not going to get a job in broadcasting. He's as dry as as a piece of unbuttered toast. Nobody yeah. wants him. No, <laughs> no, he's he's a bore fest. Yeah, he doesn't know his way around a microphone. No, he really doesn't. So he's off. That's why they. And never... he's always got an attitude. You know, when he's asked questions, he's like annoyed by them. Yeah, like you're the idiot. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I may so very I'm well be the idiot. Question, I, may very, I may very well be the idiot, but okay. Hey, we got a minute left. We sure do, okay. and I think we should wrap it up, Gary. Okay. This has been a good show. It has. I want the Ravens to win. No. Good Lord. What am I saying? You, you've no. lost your mind. 
You've stepped it, out of your It's that deja <laughs> blue you're drinking. <laughs> You've stepped out of your mind. Now, I want Cincinnati, Cincinnati to win and, and, and Cleveland to win. Two teams are going to lo- uh, lose. The Ohio and, teams must win. It must be an Ohio we sweep. We may do. And they're both in Ohio. We may do a little. At the same. No, they're once Thursday. Right? Yes. Okay. Thurs- Thursday night is the Cincinnati Ravens game. Okay. And then we're on regular time on Sunday, hopefully in the slop, Steph. Well, next week, uh, are we going to be at the brewery? Yeah. Okay, how are we going to take calls? Where's that music coming from? I don't know. How are we going to take calls? Thank you. You know what? We'll talk about that after the show. All right, so go Browns. Big win. God, I love it. I love it. It was great. All right. Thanks, guys. We love you.